Hey everybody, it's Yasmin here. How are you going? So today I am uh, actually shopping. Let me just show you where I am. Uh, it's a shop called Elm, I think. I'm not really sure. I haven't been here before. And uh, I just thought I'd say sort of further to yesterday what we were talking about. Oh, hello, everybody. Jump, people jumping on. So, okay, as you know, I'm waiting still for going ahead with the renovations. So part of, uh, and, you know, finding out how we're doing, part of coming here today is because it's kind of like positive affirmation you know like oh it's all gonna be fine we're all gonna move ahead and you know it's sort of like being positive but I also wanted to say that yesterday at some point I can't remember now I drew a card and um, I believe it was the new moon in um, what is it darling I'm just doing a little live it was the new moon in Aquarius, which basically said, you know, detach, step back, all those kind of Aquarius things, which wasn't that surprising. <sighs> but I was thinking, you know, and I did do that a bit, um, but I, I was thinking I didn't actually look at what it said for the manifesting bit because I was kind of, in a way, I, it's not the card I wanted, but you know, it's the card I got, it's the card we all got. And uh, so I just wanted to say quickly, you know, when we get a card it's important to listen and that card said call in Archangel Uriel so you can respond um, compassionately but also dispassionately in other words if people are winding you up that you don't um, respond you know too passionately which is definitely one of my flaws so I thought I would just sit, as I'm sitting here, oh, thank you, Kathy Giovannoni. Um, as I'm just sitting here, I thought, let's call in Archangel Uriel for those of us who need to respond um, compassionately and dispassionately to someone or something. So just close your eyes, just breathe. And we call in Archangel Uriel, Archangel Uriel, thank you for helping me to respond compassionately and dispassionately. And now I'm going to do a little affirmation. I'm so excited. All my dreams are coming true. I'm so excited. All my dreams are coming true. <gasps> Say it with me. I'm so excited. All my dreams are coming true. Oh my God. I'm so excited. All my dreams are coming true. Yay. I'm so excited, all my dreams are coming true. Yay, I'm so excited, all my dreams are coming true. Yay, I'm so excited, all my dreams are coming true. Yay, say it with me, I'm so excited because all my dreams are coming true. So there you go. I just wanted to share that. I actually, I was actually going to um, do a little live before I left home and do a card for the day. So I will do that. I'm also going to tell you something for those of you who've watched this far. Uh, if you're wondering about my Moonology certification course, which um, I think this filter might give me. No, I thought it gave me false eyelashes. Um, if you're wondering about my Moonology certification course, if you wanted to get it before and you didn't, I'm just going to let you know, just really quietly, very soon, we're going to be putting it back on special. So if you want to learn astrology, which honestly is amazing and helpful, um, just give it a couple of days because I'll be able to tell you more. And actually, speaking of astrology and speaking of a couple of days, I'm also going to say, you know, like right now, I'm really wound up because I still haven't heard back from the guy who runs the company. Of our, who's doing the renovations and uh, I'm doing what the card said which is to back off so that's fine but I'm still really wound up and I keep arguing with my poor husband and all that because uh, I'm so wound up and anxious about it um, even though I feel intuitively it's going to work out but you know just waiting 
Um, I actually am aware as well, there is a sun Saturn square coming. So, you know, maybe I have to wait till after that, um, you know, for some results. Anyway, back to, uh, oops, back to positive visualizations. Can't wait till the house gets done. There's my beloved husband wandering around. So one more time, should we say it three more times? I'm so excited, all my dreams coming true. Here we go. Do it with feeling. Or let's say I'm so, everything is always working out perfectly for me. That's a Louise Hay one, let's do that. Everything is always working out perfectly for me. Everything is always working out perfectly for me. Everything is always working out perfectly for me. I'll probably see you later. Ciao.